<clears throat> well, you can't have gas pressure without a container. And there's no demonstration provided for that gas pressure without a container. Go on any internet search you want and show me a demonstration of gas pressure without a container. Earth is a pressurized system. It has gas pressure. Air is a gas. And it's pressurized. And they know that. So what's keeping the pressure on? Hmm? Do you feel the pressure? And also, the Coriolis effect is a load of shit. You have to have two frames of reference for the Coriolis to work. The ground that you stand on is the one frame of reference. And then the atmosphere that's spinning around the Earth, or the Earth spinning through the atmosphere, is the second frame of reference. They're so fucked in the head, mentally retarded, they'll tell you that they fire a bullet out of a, out of a gun, and now they have to compensate for the Coriolis effect because the bullet is now in the atmosphere and they have to worry about the Coriolis effect to account for the spin of the earth for long range sniper shots. Please explain to me how a bullet is any different than a plane or a helicopter by the logic that they impose on people stating that the bullet is now in that second frame of reference and the earth is now spinning underneath that bullet. That means that the earth is spinning underneath a helicopter. The earth is spinning underneath a plane. And you can't listen to me. You fucking retard. You fucking adjusting your tie, pushing up your glasses, taking out your number two shit fucking pencil. Fucking retard. You cannot have it both ways. What do you mean by that? Well, if the atmosphere and everything spins with the earth, there is no Coriolis effect. Right? So, if the atmosphere is now a separate frame of reference, that means that the bullet is now left the ground, the earth that you're standing on, that is spinning. Which we know is not the case. So, the Coriolis effect is a load of shit. And um, unless you're in an airplane or a helicopter, and say for a helicopter, for example, you should buy the logic that they impose on people based on the bullet. And you can, you know this, everybody knows this because they fucking drill it into your head. That means that you should be able to sit in a helicopter while the earth rotates at 15 degrees per hour over a 24 hour cycle. And I guarantee you, you can go in a helicopter and you can sit there and hover all day long. And that fucking earth is not going to move one smidge. And uh, I have a video that's going to come up next that explains in like right after this video in full detail, like the high amount of intelligence that's behind the Coriolis effect, the um, amazing uh, technology and intelligence that these brilliant engineers and astrophysics come up with, astrophysicists. So I'd like you to hear after this, like it's, it's brilliant. It's, it's really, honestly, it's on their level. It's, it's, I can't comprehend it. It's just too much for me. Yeah. Have a good day.